get ready, everyone, for Tuesday afternoon NBA action on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan, along with Greg Anthony and Brent Berry, our terrific analysts, and David Aldridge is our sideline reporter. It's the Chicago Bulls and the Phoenix Suns. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. They've got Pippen. Grant is out there with Kurt Wright. Then it's Jordan. And it's Paxson in at the one spot. Clock at four. Here's Pippen. Phoenix grabs the miss. Now here's Durant. Let's the free fly. The shot goes in. First shot, first best. Amazing ball handling ability allows Durant to gain separation from even the most locked down defender. Grant with a screen on Allen. Pippen is just a Grant. Pippen the pass to Grant. Score the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. And the official signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. And about a minute gone here in the first quarter. Grant finds Pippen. Bulls moving the ball around. Cartwright the pass to Grant. Here's Pippen. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Look how Pippen stays nimble inside, adjusting to get the shot off despite the contact. And he can't hit the second. He was able to tie it up. But he has to be disappointed that he could not give his team the lead. Grant against Durant. The rebound by Grant. A lot of defenders choose to just back up off of him when he's in that tight, try to avoid the in one, and this time they're not backing off. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. Well, he's going to just keep going now. That's early confidence for him. Here's Jordan after the made shot from KD. To the paint. Here's Cartwright. Rebound by Nurkic. And now here's Nurkic. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. And KD, here we go. Off with the layup. Uh, for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. Paxson passes to Grant. And it's sent back by KD. Durant covering a lot of territory with his length. No good on that one. Good D by Jordan. Paxson outside. Releases from 15. He gets it in there. And he's not going to miss many of those, especially that wide open. No, he's automatic from the mid-range, and the defense knows that. It's a mistake to give up a shot like that. Here's KD. Finds the bottom of the bucket from 15 feet out. Durant's got seven points. Now, this is the toughest shot, supposedly, in the NBA to get down. Durant's not having much of a problem from the mid-range. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. For the three. Another three for Phoenix. And man, you look at that release from Duran. He makes hitting a three look like a layup with that size and touch. Maxson kicks to Pippen. From about 16. And there's Michael Jordan, the assist by Pippen. Such a critical part of how their offense is going to flow. Things are only working when he seems to be on the floor. And Katie throws it down. Yeah, a lot of years behind Kevin Durant, but that doesn't mean he's still not going to get up. And there's the call on Durant. That is his first foul of the game. Chicago making some changes. Purdue, he's checked in for Grant. Hodges comes in for Jordan. And Armstrong subbed in for Baxson. Armstrong against Booker. KD comes with the double team. Bounce pass, Pippen. Shot clock at six. Purdue with a screen on Allen. Pippen with a wide open look. Offline with his three. Picked his pocket. Bulls shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. And he can't get the first one. And the second free throw, good. Oh, 
KD looking around. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's Kevin Durant making headlines and highlights for the Sun. That quarter had to take a lot out of him. He racked up 12 points. And we'll be right back after this. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. And taking a look at the Suns' performance here, guys, uh, what have they been doing or not doing? Stingy on the defensive end in that first quarter. They were just getting up into people. Just a, a great job, really, of making the game ugly, trying to muck it up a little bit out there. So on the floor for Chicago to start the second quarter. Hobson is out there with Levinson. Then there's Purdue. And it's B.J. Armstrong, and it's Jordan in at the two-guard. Bulls trail by six. Armstrong passes to Jordan. Shoots over Beal, and Jordan gets it to go. Jordan's got six. Yeah, and when we think about the excitement that Jordan brings to the game, but, but what about the offensive fundamentals? The, the, the man is a perfectionist. Now, here's Durant. 14 points for him. Armstrong against Booker. Spins. Armstrong kicks to Jordan. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. To the right side. Here's Hobson. At three off the mark. Phoenix leading by four. Here's KD. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Look how Durant uses his wily frame there to get off those shots. Not an easy shot, but for him, man, it looks easy. Some changes for Chicago. Grant comes in for Livingston. And it's Paxson in for Hobson. Booker against Armstrong. Pass to Jordan. Here's Grant. And it's Chicago scoring again. More than just a low post guy, Grant can also get it done from outside. A fadeaway. Durant, no good. D giving him that shot, and that's probably not a good idea, but I guess they knew what they were doing that time. And there's the call on Devin Booker. That is his first foul of the game. Bill Carp, he's checked in for Purdue. Coming out of the floor for the Bulls, number 24. Bill Cartwright. And now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. Shoots from the elbow. And the rebound by Nurkic. Suns leading by five. It's Durant with the drive. Count the basket. KD's got 19 points. Durant almost seven feet. It's just hard to believe watching how well he moves. Here's Jordan. And Durant sends it back. And they get it back. Jordan with it. He's picked up by KD. Can't cash in on the 10-foot jump. 143 left in the first half. Bulls trail by seven. Kicks it out to Grant. Pass to Jordan. and Grant gets the assist. And it's eight points for Jordan. And you can just see the extraordinary competitiveness. MJ staying laser focused after absorbing the contact. Now here's Nurkic. Now Kevin Durant. He's got 19. Just five on the clock. A shot that time. Not on target. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for Chicago. Trailing by five. Here's KD. And then Durant with the dunk. Well, long legs of Kevin Durant. They're galloping down the lane. I don't know how you catch up there. 
52 seconds left to play in the first half. Outside, Jordan. And the pass to Armstrong. Here's Grant. Outside, Jordan. Back to Grant. Jordan looking around. And the three ball is good. Jordan's got seven points here in this quarter. And was it really a long distance shooter in college? Jordan really worked on his range ever since being drafted. Now here's Booker. Still scoreless. Grant against KD. Again, the miss by KD. Paxson kicks to Armstrong. Here's Jordan. And it's good. Two points. Jordan's got 13. And so it's Kevin Durant making headlines and highlights for the Phoenix Suns. It's been an excellent game for him offensively. He's got 21 points and counting. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. What a game we're seeing from Kevin Durant. He's been nothing short of a wall at the rim so far in this one, single-handedly providing great rim protection. Been aggressive to block shots, but also avoiding fouls. That's a, that's a heavy presence inside. The big three for the Suns, all on the floor. Booker and Beal is the guards, and KD at the four. Grayson Allen is out there with Nurkic. That's who's out there for Phoenix. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. We all know Achilles' injuries used to be career-ending. Kevin Durant says Dominique Wilkins was one of the first guys who came back the same. It was a motivation and gave me confidence that I could do the same. And now Wilkins says KD has really taken hold of this and become the spokesperson for this injury. So we're passing the torch. Kevin, back to you. Yeah, passing the torch, David. Thank you so much. Jordan, the pass to Carter. Up top, Jordan. He's covered by Beal. Back to Jordan. Paxson kicks to Jordan. Six on the shot clock. For the tie. And Scotty Pippen, the bucket on the assist by Jordan. Pippen's got it all tied up now for Chicago. Not much else the D could do. Sometimes Pippen is going to bury shots right in your face. Jordan with it. Now Beal defending. For the lead. Rebound by the Suns. KD's got his fourth rebound in this one. The 10 footer. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. Here's Chicago. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half. Grant outside. To the middle. Here's Jordan. Excellent D there from Allen. Katie against Grant. Outside Durant. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It goes on Horace Grant. Just not sure there's a good way to guard Kevin Durant. He's too tall. 
He's too skilled and he's too quick with that relief. The Bulls making a switch here. Armstrong's checked in. Now you can tell he's feeling confident right now at the line and when he's on, he can be lights out. Kept alive. Pass to Paxson. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. No good from Grant. And so it's Durant with it. He'll bring it up for Phoenix. A two-point game. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. And again, it's the Suns missing. Here's Chicago. Here's Paxson. Not wasting any time and taking the shot and knocking it down. And he should thank the team for those two points. Nobody paid much attention to him on that play. KD against Grant. Now here's Durant. He's tightly guarded. The rebound by Cartwright. And there hasn't been anything easy for him in this period. No, I haven't seen him in, in comfortable spots or at least spots we've seen in this offensive set that are allowing him to settle in. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. Durant inside. Working on Grant. KD's shot is good. KD's got six points in the quarter. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Pippen. Rebound by the Suns. You've got to commend the aggressiveness, but he was a little too anxious in trying to get that shot over the stifling D there. Pass to Allen. The Trey. From deep three-point land. Out to KD. Over Armstrong. Persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. KD's got 29. And Nurkic getting more and more comfortable at finding the open men on this team. And so it's Kevin Durant making headlines and highlights for the Phoenix Suns. He has been a determined scorer today. 29 points altogether for him. And I think there's more where that came from. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. And while we can now, let's take a look at today's State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and what a beautiful feat. The well, coaches talk about it all the time, but to be able to play with that kind of feel, nice play collaborating, improvising, and organic. And with three quarters behind us, we start the fourth quarter in what is still anybody's ball game. So the Bulls five right now. We've got Brown. Purdue is out there with Livingston. And it's Michael Jordan. And it's Armstrong in at the shooting guard. Here is Durant. The Bulls getting the bucket. Booker finds Durant. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Chicago making a switch here. I just checked in. Number 14. Craig Hodges. Now the Bulls with it. to Livingston. Wants to get it to Jordan and does. The youth won't find a much more entertaining sight. I call that slam dunk contest level. The Suns trailing. KD with it. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute from the books. And that will be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Well, we're always wishing good health on any player, but for Kevin Durant to remain that way, it's when we get a chance to see something special offensively. Chicago making a switch here. Bill Cartwright, he's checked in for Purdue. Grant comes in for Livingston. Pippen's checked in for Hodges. And it's Paxson in for B.J. Armstrong. Can't afford these defensive breakdowns especially down the stretch yeah, breakdowns like this are only going to hurt you moving forward and late in the game establish some trust and make the defense come together he does that so well at his size he's always a threat 
to throw it down. Booker against Paxson. We're just over a minute and a half now into the fourth. Jordan inside. Guarded by KD. Out of bounds. Phoenix takes possession. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. Now here's Beal. Left side Durant. Beal finds KD. One fifty-six left in the fourth quarter. Puts up a deep three. Offensive rebound. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Nurkic. One forty-six left in the fourth quarter of this one. And here is Jordan. Grant at the elbow. Uncovered. Good. And it's Jordan picking up the assist. Durant's got the lead up to two now for Chicago. They can get back in front with some points right here. Yeah, they got behind, but really hung in there. They didn't let the score get out of hand. Man, I'll tell you what, the pressure is cranked up. Who better to call than this guy? Jordan against Beal. Jordan outside, and it's Pippen in the corner. Grant outside. Six to shoot. Jordan the pass to Paxson. Misses from short range. Paxson's gone two of six here tonight from the field. And there's the call on Durant. That's his third foul of the game. Ooh, that one stings there. Hurts so much more to turn the ball over, especially with how tight the game is. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Guys, during that last break, I heard Phil Jackson as he talked with the team. Now it's a close one, so Coach asked his team to keep their focus. He said this game's going to come down to mistakes. If we play clean, we'll win. Great game tonight. Let's see how it winds up. Guys? All right, David, thanks. That is world class. Love seeing that there. A huge possession, and he nets it. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for the ball. They trail by one. Over Beal. Hexen outside. Jordan the pass to Pippen. Shot clock at five. The feed to Grant. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. Yeah, you, you have to do that, though. You can't just let them dribble the game. 20 seconds left to play here in the fourth. And now they decide to foul intention. Right on the first, and that will put them up by two. I don't know if fouling Booker is ever a good idea. I mean, he is a great free throw shooter, and he's made for these moments. Huge free throws, bumps the lead up to three, and now they simply have to guard against the three ball. Twenty seconds left in the fourth quarter. Pippen the pass to Paxson. Deal against Jordan. Can't knock in the three. And now they foul and stop the clock. You have to foul, but I'm sure they would have liked to foul for someone different. So the first one drops, and that gives them a four-point cushion. You get the feeling that KD loves the pressure because he knows what he's capable of doing for this team. Breathe easy now. The biggest free throws in the game, and he's coming through. So it's the Suns taking the W in a close one. 
that was a fun night of basketball and fabulous finish as they continued to wait out until the very last moment to seal it. And there are so many times when you see these tight games won at home, that advantage of having that crowd behind you oftentimes is the ultimate X factor. And that about wraps it up for Brent Berry, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. As New Balance presents our player of the game, Kevin Durant.